Welcome to the Michigan Runner Show. Join us each time as we explore the people, the places, and the events that shape our great sport. The 16th annual running of the Trail Marathon and Half Marathon is brought to you by Brooks Performance Footwear and Apparel and by Running Fit. Good morning. We're here with Randy Stepp at the 16th annual Running Fit Trail Marathon and Half Marathon. Isn't it a great day for this? Yeah, there must be some mistake here. This is 16 years, and this is the first time I think I've seen the sun in the morning. Well, now, it's supposed to be cold, rainy, and muddy, isn't it? Yeah, it's very unusual. What's re it's like cheating on a day like this for a race director. So, Randy, you get people from all over the country coming to this because it's a rather unusual race. It's a trail marathon. Yeah, um, you know, you the people that are, the trail runners are actually more from the east and west coast, kind of mountain states people, so we get a lot of them that are seeking out now that the 50 state uh, run people now there's some 50 state trail run people it's, we have a campsite where uh, running fit sets up a campsite in the evening we kind of sit around and um, just very different than the road marathons we you know we put out a road marathon in March the Martian marathon and it's day and night compared to being out here in the woods can you describe the course a little bit um, what we it's a uh, two 13 mile loops in the middle of nowhere and there's very few p places that uh, you even come to uh, a road. We have one road that we cross twice in the 13-mile loop, so no traffic control problems. We're here with John Labossier, the director of the park here, and you helped start this marathon with Randy and Jeff Gaff a few years ago. Is that right? Uh, that's correct. Uh, I, I welcomed uh, them into the park uh, at a come, come and run. Uh, it was uh, 56 runners that ran off in the rain. Well, Randy, we're looking forward to see people take off and uh, finish, and uh, looks like we're having a, a nice sunny day for it. Oh, it's amazing. That's Like I said, it's like cheating. All right, ready? Go!
We're here with the winner of the trail marathon today, is P.F. Popkin. Popkin, right. And you're from Cadillac, Michigan, is that right? Yeah. You had a great race. How'd it go for you? It went really well. I started off trying to break three hours and got a little warm, so I didn't make that, but ended up keeping the lead. Why do you like trails? Um, it's just more exciting than all the pounding on the road, and the fastest person doesn't always win. Hey, Rob, what kind of race did you have? Your, Rob is the winner of the half marathon today. Uh, it felt pretty good. I uh, just ran comfortable and kind of broke up about six miles, and I just cruised. I don't know. It felt pretty good. Oh, Rob, that's your name, right? Took off in about six miles or so. Just schooled us big time. Yeah. Took us out of the race in about 100 meters. My third one here. It's a great race. This is my favorite trail, favorite place to run, period. Um, beautiful day for it. <laughs> she totally surprised me. <laughs> I kept looking back, I didn't see her anywhere. No, I, then, thought, I thought she was about four minutes ahead. I didn't see her the whole race until it last three quarter of a mile, and then I saw her in sight, and I couldn't believe it, so I started <laughs> looking it, but I was just a tad short. Hi, I... we're here with Lemon James, who just finished the half marathon. How did it go for you today? It was great fun. Had a great time out there. Great weather, and uh, good time, and good competition. We're here with Tom Henderson, who's a veteran of the half marathon here. How'd it go for you, Tom? Well, ran it today as a training run, and you think the night before or the morning, like, oh, this is going to be easy, I'm not racing. Then you get out there, and it's just as hard as when you race. So you're thinking, why? Well, I should be racing. At least I'd be done earlier. Why are trail runs harder? Well, th this one is hard because there's so many steep, long uphills. I mean, your thighs are just burning away and if you dare look up you see the top of the hill about another 200 yards up and it's like oh my goodness and then if you look up you might miss that root in front of you if you look up you're destined to hit that one root that's, that's got your name on it <laughs> The Trail Marathon and Half Marathon have been brought to you by Brooks Performance Footwear and Apparel and by Running...